Hello, it's Brick Bros UK and we have our alternative bill for the LEGO Overwatch Omnic Bastion which has turned out quite well because we've managed to transform the figure into a scaled down version. And for an extra bonus we built a turret sentry mode from the spare parts to give you two builds for the price of one. So if you'd like to have a smaller Bastion for your Overwatch collection you can follow our step by step build tutorial at the end to make it but first let's take a closer look at our new creation. Now we only had a few spare pieces left over which was not bad going and we kept the lovely display base intact so you can still show off the figure alongside the blizzard tile. Moving on to the main build as you can see the orange omnic design looks pretty good on this smaller bastion and it's definitely recognisable as the character from the game. You'll also be pleased to know the figure keeps many of the original moving functions for play and even though it's not an accurate scale for minifigures it's a decent improvement on the original version. So if we go in for a closer look his ball jointed legs are fully flexible for walking or posing the figure. Then at the bottom of each one we added these movable brick feet to keep Bastion stable when he stood up and we attached armour pieces on the legs to bolt them out. Heading up the build you might have noticed we copied the sloping body from the original figure as it seems to fit this scale but one of the good things about the body which we're quite proud of is we kept the fun rotating mechanism so you can easily spin the body left and right for battle. Taking a look at the left side, Bastion's got an orange shoulder pad clipped above the arm. And below this we created a flexible arm to hold its stud shooting blaster which is an excellent weapon to unleash on any unwanted guests. Switching over to the right we mirrored the shoulder pad design but instead of using a flat tile we added a stud so Genyamede can hop on too. And you might have noticed we removed some of the bird's parts to reduce his size so the companion can fit Bastion's new scale. The arm's also fully flexible and we clipped on the black hand from the original build to give it a similar look. Next up on top of the body we created a simple bastion robot head which has a freely moving neck and a red eye at the front for an accurate design. Then if we turn to the back on this side we put together a crude minigun from spare pieces and for a clever touch we attached a black technic bar piece to represent the barrel. So our scaled down Omnic Bastion looks the part on the base but one of the cool things about it is it's still an excellent fully functioning figure to use in your battles. Following on from the Bastion like we already said we couldn't resist building his sentry mode turret from the spare pieces. And as you can see it's got a solid game design with these raised dark grey legs underneath. The front also features an accurate square shape with the sticker plates hanging either side and above them we attach these flick up armoured bars for a bulkier finish. But one of the neat things about this turret is we place the original quad barrel minigun piece in the centre which can tilt up and down a little for aim. Now on top of this we put together a simple bastion head as well complete with a round red eye for another game touch and on both sides you'll find more armour detail. Then if we go to the back there's a fold out stabiliser which can be flicked down to keep the turret stable when you fire it and when it's out of the way you have better access to aim the turret too. So the turret sentry mode build is a cool extra that will be fun to display next to the figure or to represent the character in a fight when he changes. On a final note then our scaled down bastion alternative build is a pretty sweet creation to make if you're after a fully functioning smaller version of the character and want his sentry mode as a bonus build. Now there is room for improvement on both creations and it's a shame Bastion's not minifigure size but when you consider the parts we had at hand it's not bad overall. And with his recognisable omnic design, accurate sentry mode turret, fully flexible body and stud shooting blaster this Bastion would be a great addition to anyone's overwatch collection or scenes and we hope you like it as much as we do. So if you love watching our review and want to turn your set into a smaller bastion and turret you should watch on now to check out our step by step build tutorial and if you're ready to go let's start the build.
And that's the finished build, so now you can enjoy our scaled down bastion and turret, or maybe you've taken inspiration from this creation to make something more awesome. Hope you enjoyed a Brick Bros UK alternative build, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.